Hey, I'm Jim Weber in the Fox 13 Weather Center. Thanks for logging on to MyFoxHurricane.com. Still watching Hurricane Larry, but the Hurricane Reconnaissance plane, they've been flying in this system throughout the morning hours, and, and they're noticing a few things. It, the pressure's actually risen a little bit. Uh, the overall structure of the storm isn't as well defined as it was just 24 hours ago, so it is starting to encounter a few issues. Now, the wind shear is light over the system, but what we're looking at is maybe some mid-level dry air working its way in. Also, they're noting uh, that maybe some upwelling of some cooler waters beneath the system. So the waters may be cooling down a little bit. And that may be contributing to a little bit of a weakening trend with this. So the overall philosophy with this is still pretty much the same that it's going to go around the ridge on that western side kind of rounding it and eventually turning towards the north and eventually the northeast and then safely out to sea not really bothering anyone although the surf and there is a tropical storm watch out for uh, bermuda as we go through the next couple of days so right now winds are at 115 miles and are currently moving to the northwest at nine miles an hour so still a major hurricane even though it's dealing with some issues it is still a major hurricane it's going to continue on that westerly track that northwesterly track weakening some as it does so and then it eventually starts to work its way into some cooler waters and then pushing on towards the north and east you can see up towards st john's you gotta watch this as we head towards uh, the weekend those would be the areas that would be affected by this as we get into the weekend and over uh, into next week as well so another area that we are watching uh, this has been classified as invest 91 i was talking about this last week working its way over the yucatan up into the gulf of mexico still at this point really a low chance of seeing anything happen with this there's just the, the conditions just aren't right in the gulf of mexico we've got some high wind shear uh, so if anything were to develop with this it would probably be close to land but more likely after it passes over the peninsula and over into the atlantic so what we're looking at right now is just a big slug or a big area of tropical moisture working its way over the state and that's going to increase those rain chances over the state as we go through the next several days in fact you look at the gfs model you really don't notice much into the gulf of mexico but what you do is notice is once we get towards the weekend and i'll go ahead and circle the area because you can see it over into the atlantic and a little hint maybe of some lower pressure that by the way is larry working its way on towards eventually the north and the northeast but what you're seeing is that lower pressure kind of hanging out off the east coast and that's where we might actually start to see maybe a little bit a little bit more development with this as we head towards uh the weekend and into next week other than that the tropics are, are quiet otherwise but we will keep you updated right here on myfoxhurricane.com